And then there was one. Only one team from the DMV is still alive in the NCAA men's basketball tournament. Would you believe it's Maryland? Fear the turtle. The Terps upset seven seed UConn to advance into round two. An unbelievable win that coach Mark Turgeon and his team are not taking for granted. A grind of all grinds. Uh, it's always a grind, but when you're picked 12th in a great league and you start out one and five and four and nine, it's, whew, it's kind of scary. <clears throat> we sat around last night and talked and, you know, we're, we're not dumb. We, we all thought it, this wasn't going to happen. And, uh, but we stayed the course, we stayed positive. Staying positive wasn't always easy. Playing through a pandemic has been challenging for the Terps. And there was always that worry that just like 2020, this year's tournament might not happen. You know, all that we had to go through this year with testing every day and, um, you know, not being there to see our families, not being to hang out with our friends and just making all these sacrifices, you know, it's reward. You know, everything we've been through up here, you know, just the whole experience has just been a rewarding experience, you know. Um, and we hopefully we get to keep playing. We're also just so thrilled to be here. We're just trying to enjoy the moment. It's because it got taken away last year. We just talked about how fortunate we are to be playing and a lot of people love to be in our shoes. So let's make the most of it. For Terp star Eric Ayala, the message moving forward is clear. It's do or die at this point. You know, um, you got you to gotta leave it all out there. You know, empty the tank. Um, you know, I, I wasn't ready to go home. You know, I've been having a nice time out here and. Uh, you know, just the whole environment is just a special place to be. You know, as a college basketball player, you know, as a, as a child, you dream of being in this environment. And, uh, you know, I'm just going to just keep dreaming. If you're a Maryland fan or an alum, you have a big day Monday. The men play Alabama, the winner, of course, advancing to the Sweet 16, and the Maryland women tip off at 4 o'clock in round one of their tournament, taking on Mount St. Mary's from Emmitsburg, Maryland.